Now, most of our rain jackets are three layers. So now this inner layer referred to as the inner fabric. You may hear it also referred to as the inner backing. Now, the second layer, this is going to be your waterproof, breathable membrane. Now, if you have a Gore-Tex jacket, this is gonna be that Gore-Tex membrane. Now, the outer layer is going to be known as the outer face fabric. So we have our outer face fabric the middle waterproof be the breathable membrane, and then we have the inner fabric or inner backing or the liner. Now on top of this outer face fabric, most jackets are going to have a DWR finish. And what that is is a durable water repellent finish. It's a durable water repellent finish. Now, an easy way to think about the DWR coating on this outer face fabric is to think of um, that this fabric actually has fingers and or grass on top of this. Now, once it starts to rain, those water molecules are going to come down and they're going to just sit on the top of this DWR finish and or they're gonna sit on top of the grass and or the fingers. Now over time with dirt, oil, grease, washing, sunscreen, just kind of general wear and tear, that DWR coating will actually start to degrade. And so then what happens is that those water molecules are then going to sit directly onto that outer face fabric. Now, once those water molecules are sitting on that outer face fabric, then that means that there's no grass and or fingers for that water to sit on. So your jacket starts to get wet, kind of soaked in. This is known as wet, wet out. Basically what wet out is, is where that water is sitting on that outer face fabric and it is no longer being repelled off of your jacket. So it's not beating up. Now, in order to revitalize your DWR repellent, you can do a couple of things. You can wash with a product as the Nick Wax Tech Wash, and then you can finish that wash with your TX Direct Wash-In.